me vas diciendo regular and irregular. Play, study, ok, what else? Listen, yes, ok. ¿Qué más? Uh, what? Climb, yes, climb a mountain. Repeat, arrive, yes, ok. Con esto me conformo, ok? So we have irregular, drink, go. Mm, what else? Y mira, eh. Acá tenés tus verbos irregulares. Anda mirando, yes, dale. Sleep. What else? What else? Decime, decime otros, dale. Go, ya está, eh. What else? Good, come. Mm -hmm. Ok. Well, so pay attention now. ¿Qué va a pasar acá? Yes. Tenemos verbos regulares que para convertirlos en pasado, if you want to take, if you want to make them in past, vamos a agregar la ed. Ojo acá, termina en y. Esto no es chino básico, esto es fácil. Yes. Entonces vamos a poner ied. ¿Mm? Esto va a salir. Entonces study va a quedar así. Study. Esta Y pasa a la I latina, que es la del puntito. Listen. Climbed. Arrived. Y esta ya tiene E, le agrego la D solamente. ¿Está? Ok. Entonces, ¿qué le agregamos a los verbos regular? Le agregamos la ED. ¿Qué son estos verbos? que desde hace rato te estamos haciendo estudiar. ¿Para qué? Comenzamos antes con la lista, para que ahora, cuando vos estés en el PAS, no tengas problemas de que tenés que memorizarte toda esta lista. ¿Se entiende? Entonces ya tenemos un paso avanzado, un paso por delante. Y si está todo fríamente calculado, de nada al azar, ¿eh? Ok, bueno, well, so we have, then we go to the pronunciation, then we have, los irregulares cambian. Una palabrita o toda. Por ejemplo, drink, decime el pasado. Drunk. Ok. Go. Went. <coughs> Eat. Ate. Sleep. Slept. Can. Could. ¿Es clear? Yes. Are you ready? Ready for the pronunciation? Voy a hacer con alguno nomás. Ok. Play. Played. Y acá van a sonar a veces con D, a veces con ED, yes, por ejemplo, a ver voy a poner uno, start, start, le agrego la ED, la pronunciación estoy diciendo, ¿eh? ok, atención, played, viste, played, studied, listened, climbed, arrived, ¿Vieron que a veces suena D? A veces escuchas que, yo, que al final suena D. ¿Yes? Y ahora started. 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 ¿Yes? ¿Ok? ¿Es clear? So, let's repeat. Played. Studied. Listened. Climbed. Arrived. Started. ¿Es clear? Good. Drank. Went. Ate. Slept. Good. Well, ahora sí, tenemos entonces in the past regular and irregular verbs, ¿ok? So, we are going to go. Este es el último tema gramatical que damos pasado, ¿yes? Así que todo lo que nos queda después va a ser revisar todo. Are you ready? Good. Well, the question is, what did you do? What did you do last? What did you do last? Yeah? Oops, acá se nos pasó a la teacher que controló. Se me pasó una ED. Yes, ok, good. Así que a cambiarle eso, teacher, en el cuadro. Yes, ok, plate, plate. Good. Bueno, ya la agregué yo manualmente. Ok. Well, ¿qué hiciste? Yes. What did you do last summer holidays? What did you do last summer holiday? I 
visited my friends. ¿Te das cuenta que acá tengo un verbo regular que tiene ed? Porque visité. ¿Sí? Si, esa, si no tiene ed, el verbo va a decir como en este, que sería un error acá. Jugué, jugar en el parque. Jugué en el parque. I played. ¿Ya? Viste que la agregué ahí, ¿eh? Ok. What did you do last winter holidays? I went shopping. Yes. Dale. What did you do last Saturday? Acá elijo dónde, cuándo, ¿eh? Yeah? El pasado fin de semana, el pasado miércoles, el pasado, las pasadas vacaciones de verano, de invierno. Ok. What did you do last summer holidays? I blah blah swam in the river. I ate a cake. I rode my bike, I played in the park, I went to the cinema. Is it clear? Dale, de nuevo. Ready, steady, go. What did you do last Saturday? I ate a cake. I ate at a restaurant. I danced rock and roll. I went shopping. I rode my bike at the riverside. I read at the library. Oh, yes. What did you do last summer holidays? I cooked a cake. I went shopping. I played with my friends. I ate at a, uh, at a restaurant. I swam in the beach. I played volleyball in the beach. I played tennis in the beach. Yes, I watched TV. Tienen que sonar esas ideas, ¿ok? Went to the beach, ate a cake, swam in the river, danced, no digo dance, digo danced, visited, ate, played, traveled, ¿ok? Is it clear? Good. So pay attention now. Are you ready? Yes. Lo podés ver una y otra vez. ¿Sí? Y practicarlo una y otra vez. Este año no hay excusa, no pueden haber excusas porque me tenés ahí, en tu casa. El primer año que me puedes llevar a tu casa. Ok. Mira. This is another thing. Yes, ok. What would you like to drink? Yes. Ahora que primero la teacher da todo lo que es grammar y después ya vamos directamente a lo que es el book, yes, ok, a todo lo que sean las actividades en el book, ok, y esta parte y en esta parte tenemos what would you like to drink, what would you like to um, eat, yes, ok, good. So, we have here things to eat and here things to drink. Yes? Okay. And the question is, what would you like to drink? Repetition. What would you like to drink? Or eat. Vamos a poner eat primero. Or drink. What would you like to drink? What would you like to eat? I'd like, repetition, I'd like, yes, or I would like, no would, eh, por favor no me pronuncian would, eh, is it clear? I'd like, yes, la forma corta, yes, pero cuando leemos esta palabra, good, good, repeat, good, what would you like to drink, what would you like to drink, repetition, what would you like to drink, what would you like to eat, yes, I'd like to Eat, I like to drink, bla, bla, bla. ¿Vamos? Esto es muy importante cuando te vas a un restaurante. ¿Yes? Viene el waiter o compras en un carrito o algo. Uh, hello, what would you like to drink? What would you like to drink? What would you like to eat? I would like to eat. I would like to eat. Um, acá no hay nada. Vegetables, ¿eh? Ok. Well, uh, meat. And mashed potatoes, yes. Uh, I would like to drink. What would you like? What would you like to drink? I would like to drink 
water, yes, okay, and some tea, yes. What would you like to eat? Vamos, come on. I like some pasta. What would you like to drink? I would like lemonade, yes. What would you like? What would you like to eat? I would like empanadas. What would you like to drink? I would like to drink Coke, yes? Again, what would you like to eat? I would like to eat a hamburger. Um, what would you like? What would you like to drink? I would like to drink um, water. And I would like to drink some coffee. Is it, is it clear? Anything else? ¿Qué significa anything else? Algo más. Anything else? Um, yes, please. Uh, an ice cream. Yes? Yes, please. An ice cream. Anything else? No, thank you. It's okay. Y después preguntamos, how much is it? How much is it? Esto es muy importante, ¿eh? No está ahí en el libro, pero para recordar, how much is it? ¿Cuánto cuesta? It's... Primero al peso, dólar o lo que sea. A hundred pesos. Ten pesos. Yes. No, bueno, no, sale la ten pesos. Okay. So, pay attention. What would you like to eat? I'd like to eat fish and chips. Esto es re British, eh? Fish and chips. Yes. Mmm, delicious. What would you like to eat? I'd like, I'd like to drink. I'd like to. Acordate de esto, no te olvides, eh? I'd like to uh, eat fish and chips. What would you like to um, drink? Repetition. What would you like to drink? I'd like to drink. I'd like to drink uh, some lemonade. Yes? Okay. And that is all. Yes? Can we go to the, um, to the class book? Ahora sí. Vamos volando al class book. Yes? Pages. Okay. Pam, 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 pam. Ahora todo lo que tenemos ahí ya no es nuevo. Yes, ok. Vamos a agregar eh, a la homework, study the verbs. Ya pongo toda la lista, eh. All the list. Regular and irregular. ¿Está? Yes, is it clear? Porque ahora súper, 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 súper bien nos viene, eh. Ok, 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 dale, pages, 104, 105, 106, 107, 108, 109, yes, ok, from the classbook, unit 9, um, la semana que viene tenemos revisión, eh, yes, ok, de la unit 9, la última revisión, sí, de lo, que se, de lo que es el libro. Great. Yes, ok. So let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Pam, 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 pam. Pam, pam, pam. Second grade. Pongo de nuevo. Me salió esta nube media. Ok. Ready? 104, 105, with the date, but first of all, first of all, we have to go, poner a todas esas, y primero vamos a hacer esto, ya que revisamos todo lo otro, activity book page 92, vamos a hacer la actividad que hay ahí, es un listen, listen and number, listen and number, the date in all the pages, The date here. Acordate que es un documento, ¿sí? Tiene que estar documentado lo que hacemos en clase y cuál es la manera de, de documentar lo que hacemos en clase. Yes. Putting the date, writing the date. Ok, McCain. There we are. Pam, 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 pam.
We go to page 92, activity book. Page 92. Primero vamos a arrancar con esto. First of all, the activity book. Page 92, page 92, exercise 2. Listen and number. Listen and number. Unit 9, recording 5. Listen and number. Then... So what do we do first? ¿Qué hacemos primero antes de empezar un listening? Before a listening, pay attention, pay attention, warning. Read. Restaurant, post office. Acuérdate, mano así, te toca repetir, ¿eh? Por más de que no escuches el sonido, ¿eh? Restaurant, pam, post office, pam, park, bakery, bookshop, chemist, supermarket, cinema, department store, department store, bank. Ok. Are you ready? Good. Yes. Put the number. Después solo vos vas a poner el nombre mirando las palabritas de arriba. Ok. Is it clear? Then you are going to write the words. Yes. Under the drawing. What? What? There's a chemist. Chemist? Two. There's a supermarket. 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 Yes, mira bien. Supermarket. Three. There's a post office. Post office. Post office. Four. There's a restaurant. 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 Five. There's a bookshop. There's a bookshop. Six. There's a park. There's a park. Seven. There's a department store. There's a department store. Eight. There's a bakery. A bakery. Mm. Nine. There's a bank. There's a bank. Ten. There's a cinema. Cinema. Okay, and you can repeat it, rewind it. it. Yes, lo rebobinas y lo repetís si te quedó dudas. Okay, and then you write it. Is it clear? Good. So let's go to page 104. 104. Ready? Okay, so we are what city? Of these cities, do you like London or Rio de Janeiro? Ah, oh, both are okay. Yes, okay. I like both of them. I learned Lon I know London. I visited London in the past, but I don't know. I didn't visit Rio de Janeiro. Yes, I like London. I know London. I visited London, but I don't know. Yes, Rio de Janeiro, I didn't go, but um, the pictures are beautiful, the beach is beautiful, the mountains are beautiful, the cable car, yes, but on the other side, <clears throat> you can relax in London, in the parks there, you know, um, you can go shopping, you can go sightseeing, yes, vieron ahí el red bus, si, sí, ese se llama double decker, Bus. Y supongo que es Harold's la que está ahí, ¿sí? Que es una tienda muy, muy emblemática de London. Harold's, yes, okay. And there are a lot of things to buy. A lot of souvenirs. Oh, teddy bears. They are very, very cute. Yes, muy tierno. Okay, well, so let's listen and read. Vamos siguiendo. Prepare the highlighter. Va a haber algo que subrayar seguramente. Ok. Ready, steady, and blah, blah, blah. Go. Unit 9. Recording 13. Listen and read. Amazing cities. There are many amazing cities in the world. London, UK. There are lots of parks. This. So first of all, amazing, vas a subrayar, 
la palabra amazing, yes, ok. Ups, hay todos los, los cuadros de la ficha. Ok. Wait, amazing, yes, ok. Is Hyde Park. There are lots of parks. This is Hyde Park. People relax here. This is Harrods department store. It's very fancy. Some people have afternoon tea here. Mm. You can buy fantastic toys here too. Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. You can go to beautiful beaches here. You can take a cable car up Sugarloaf Mountain too. I was there yesterday. It was great. Okay, well, so, uh, amazing. What is amazing? Wow, this is amazing. Yes, asombroso. Muy bien, alguien contestó ahí en la casa. Yes, and then you have the Hyde Park. Yes, it's a very, very beautiful, beautiful park. Very beautiful park. And um, it's a very big place. And there are a lot of trees. It's very green. It's beautiful. Así que cuando vayan a, al Hyde Park en London, acuérdense de la dicha. Yes, ok. Bueno, well, y después tenemos Harrods, Harrods, que es una, lo que ya te dije antes, una muy famosa y fancy, yes, como Nancy Clancy, Nancy Fancy Clancy, yes, it's fancy, it's amazing. You can drink your tea, yes, they are. Yes, and is everything prepared? You can have, go with your friends, yes, and drink tea with friends and, is, um, and eat delicious cupcakes. Yes, delicious cupcakes, yes, and it's very, very fancy. <coughs> Sorry, some people have afternoon tea. You can buy fantastic toys. Eso es lo que te dije. The teddy bears are, oh my God. When you go there, you can stop, you can stop looking. Wait a minute. You can stop looking at the toys. They are amazing. There are a lot of toys, yes, okay? Bueno, ahí arriba vas a subrayar la palabra amazing. Y aquí, department store, otra vez. Yes, okay. And in Rio de Janeiro, yes, a cable car, yes, cable car, que ahí se, el cable car, ya lo ven, ¿vieron? Te tomas la, um, el cable car, yes, que va por el cable, eso es lo que se ve ahí, yes, ok, y podés ver todo, todo, todo el panorama, qué lindo. Seguramente habrán ido, porque la mayoría de las personas, I don't know, I haven't gone to Brazil, yes. Okay, but they say it's a very, very beautiful place. Yes, yeah? okay. Entonces vamos a, eh, a subrayar la palabra cable car. Yes, is it clear? Good. Y ahí decidiste cuál es el que te gusta más. Yes. Yeah? Yes, okay. Sí, Rio de Janeiro o London. Both are very Amazing cities, yes, okay. I would like to go um, in to Rio de Janeiro and be there in the cable car, yes. See, es muy lindo, yes. I have been in, uh, in Bariloche, La Rosilla, que también tiene un lindo panorama, pero esto es, eh, este teleférico es wow. Entonces, por el cable car, bueno, ya se ve que es el teleférico, sí, yes, okay. So, let's go here to page 105, listening, yes, listen and read, unit 9, recording 14, listen and read, excuse me, where's the bakery, it's on Green Street, is it next to the bank? No, it's next to the bookshop. Thank you. Okay, and you already know this, where is to ask for directions, okay? 
This is done. So let's go to page 106, 107, yes? Look and circle. Look and circle. Was a wasn't. She was a wasn't. Decía en casa antes de redondear, ¿eh? Porque es un tipo multiple, multiple choice, vamos a hacer, ¿eh? Oral también y vos vas redondeando. She was a wasn't at the bookshop. She was. Good. Number two. He was a wasn't at the department store. Was. I was a wasn't at the chemist. Wasn't. Four. He was or wasn't at the post office? Wasn't. Now you have to write. Where or weren't? Acordate. Para. You. We. They. Were. Okay. You. Weren't born. Two. You. Were happy. Three. They. We're angry. Parece my daughters. Yes. <laughs> okay. Four. Happy. Oh, we were. We weren't happy. We weren't happy. Look, the robot is broken. Good. So let's go to page 107. 107. Is it clear? Ya estamos por terminar, chicos. Okay. Good. Look and read. Put a tick or a cross. He was at the park, at the bank. Tick. Decilo vos primero en casa. Responde antes que yo. You were sad. Tick. She wasn't bored. Hmm. Cross. No estaba aburrida, dice. Yes, okay. Y está aburrida. Yes. They weren't at the supermarket. Cross, they were. Sí que están. They were, we were scared. Tick. Están con un miedo. I was at the department store. Wow, this is teacher Ruth. Ahí va la teacher Ruth. I was at the department store. Tick. Okay, good. So let's go to 108, 109. Now we go to... Listen activity. Listen and say. Dale. Listen and number. Yes? Okay. So we are going to say and we are going to repeat. Ready. Param, 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 param. Steady. Taran, taran, taran. Y van a esperar un rato más. Yes? Okay. Because I have to go to another part of the audios. Yes? Okay. Natural signs. Are there simple? Language booster three. Recording one. Listen and say. Lemonade. Ice cream. Ice cream. Lemonade. Burger. Burger. Juice. Juice. Water. Water. Fruit. Fruit. Now listen and number. Now listen and number. Number one is already done. One. I have juice to drink. Two. I have a burger to eat. Burger. Three. I have lemonade to drink. Lemonade. Four. I have fruit to eat. I have fruit. Five. I have water to drink. Water. Six. I have ice cream to eat. Ice cream. Yes. Okay. Calo que tomo cada uno. Let. Then we go to listen again and tick or cross. Tick or cross. Language Booster 3, recording 2. Listen again. So we have lemonade, hamburger, juice, ice cream, water and fruit. In and tick 
or cross. One. I have juice to drink. Two. Juice. Entonces una cross, porque hay una lemonade. Mm. I have a burger to eat. Yeah, it's a tick. Three. I have lemonade to drink. Tick. No, this is orange juice. Yes, cross. Four. I have fruit to eat. Fruit. Five. A cross. I have water to drink. A tick. Six. I have ice cream to eat. Cross. Y, of course, quiero que esté subrayado el cuadrito. I have mate to drink. I have water to drink. Yes. I have a sandwich to eat. I or you have juice to drink. Y ahora nos vamos a lo que estuvimos aprendiendo hoy. Yes, ok. Good. Ready? Language Booster 3. Recording 4. Listen and read. Hello. What would you like? I'd like a double cheeseburger and some fruit. Would you like a drink? Yes, please. I'd like some juice. Anything else? No, thanks. Voy a marcar la palabra anything else. Anything else? Anything else? ¿Y qué voy a hacer? Le voy a poner algo más. Algo más? Yes, okay. Voy a completar este cuadrito que dice would you like? Con comida. ¿Se hace de cuenta que le preguntas a alguien en la familia? Would you like... Contestame vos en casa. Yo te digo, would you like an ice cream? No, thanks. Well, would you like some coffee? Yes, please. Would you like um, a hamburger? No, thanks. Good. Is it clear? And bye-bye. Yes, okay. I explain the homework. Explico la tarea. Clase que viene, tenemos revisión de la unidad 9. En la foto pizarra te puse todos los tópicos, ¿sí? Que vamos a um, tener en la revisión, ¿ok? Toda la unidad 9. Uh, pasado de was aware, del verbo to be. Verbos regulares e irregulares, ¿sí? What did you do, para responder what did you do. Um, what would you like, que te gustaría tomar, que te gustaría beber, los lugares, supermarkets, uh, train station, yes, ok, good. Well, um, pages from the homework. Ninety nine, ninety seven, perdón, ninety seven, ninety seven. Okay. Well, what do we have here? Yes. Okay. Look and write. Cable car, mountain, beach, pongo el lugar. Después de leer, vas a ir otra vez a la a, a la a lo que leímos de London y de Rio de Janeiro. Y después vas a, a hacer el multiple choice. London is in A, the UK or the USA. Mm, there aren't a lot of parks in London or there are a lot of parks. Harrods is a department store or a supermarket. ¿Está? Ok, no ponga cualquier cosa, ok. Uh, 99, 98, no, 99. You have all the things, bakery, dad, sister, mom, 
and you have to complete the test. Today is my mom's birthday. We are at a, obviamente va a venir un lugar. Yes, ok. Primero leo todas las palabritas. My, where, y acá te hago una pistita, subraya, where, was, was, yes, para que te dé la pista. Sí, el sujeto va a ser plural o va a ser singular. Entonces, si tenés where, sabes que vas a elegir un plural. ¿Mm? Ok, yes. Write and draw. Y después vas a escribir ahí, esto ya sobre vos. Today is my, my father's birthday. We are at a restaurant. My, family, my mother and I were at a What? Department store yesterday. They've got a present. My sister was at a restaurant. Yes. Or was at a bookshop. And my brother, perdón, porque dice he's got acá. My brother, my brother was at a bookshop and he's got a present. Yes, a book. My was at a, yes, my, what? My sister was at a, or my friend was at a mm, 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 bakery and she has got a birthday cake. My father is very surprised. Yes, y dibujo el birthday ahí, ¿está? Entonces, cada uno de los personajes estuvo en un lugar porque I was at the bakery. I bought, a cake. I bought a cake. I bought. ¿Viste que dije compré? No dije I buy. Dije el pasado de buy que es bought. I bought a cake. I was at the department store. I bought a pair of jeans. I was at a book um, bookshop. I bought a book. Yes, okay. Good. So let's go to uh, 100. Ciento, cien. Look and write. Tenés todos los across. Los que van across y todos los que van down. ¿Ok? Across y down. ¿Yes? And hacer el crossword. Y después, she, I was at the book, uh, book shop yesterday. Si tiene una cross, I wasn't. He wasn't, she was. ¿Ok? Y después, miramos a las chicas que dicen angry, scared, sad, happy, bored, and surprised. Y completamos con where o weren't. Si estuvieron o no estuvieron. Yes? A hundred and one places. Lugares desordenados and put in order and make the correct word. Yes? Si en todos, find our circle. Comidas, read and match. Draw and write about your favorite food and drink. Acá podemos escribir. I have a pie. Yes? A pie. To uh, eat, I have uh, water to drink. Y dibujo mis comidas. Y después poner en orden el, el diálogo de cuando pedimos algo. Yes, what would you like a drink? What would you like? Hello, what would you like? Yes, I would like blah, 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 blah. Okay, anything else? Yes, please, or no thanks. Okay, completamos el uso de diferentes food and drinks. I like a double cheeseburger and... Otra comida. Yes, please. I like some. A drink. Yes. Ok. And um, bye, bye. Well, that was all. Study. Mirate este video para repasar. Mirate el video de la clase pasada para repasar. Porque ahí está toda la aplicación en, estas, en esta clase de esta semana. Tuesday and Thursday. Lo que es PAS. Y hoy di revisión otra vez de todo. Así que tenés todas las tools, las herramientas para ser súper successful. Es y todo eso. Ok. Well. Bye-bye, second grade. Mwah. Happy weekend. Bye-bye.